YBN Tutorial – How to View or Submit Your Semi-Annual or Quarterly Reports Online Before you start, you must log in to your YBN account. Then click on the Semi-Annual Quarterly Reports link. Then click the Continue button. Then click on the Semi-Annual Quarterly Reports link. Click on the Semi-Annual Report link to start the process. Answer all of the questions and fill in the correct information if necessary. If there are no changes, then click the No buttons. It is a good idea to click the Save Progress button so that if you don't have time to finish, the next time you go to the YBN website to complete the process, you can pick up where you left off. Click the Next button to continue. Then, continue answering the yes or no questions appropriately and press the Next button. If you have any changes that you need to report, in this case we will choose a change in income, fill in the appropriate information below and then click the Next button to continue. You will be given the opportunity, at the end of this process, to upload documents for verification purposes. Carefully check over your eligibility status report for any inaccuracies. Sign electronically then press the Submit button. Congratulations! You have just successfully submitted your SAR-7. Now you may start choosing the verification documents you wish to submit. In order to upload a verification document, it must first be scanned and stored on your computer. Click the Start Submitting Verifications Now button. In this case, we will upload a document that is stored on this computer. In a future enhancement, you will be able to upload documents with smart devices such as an iPhone or iPad. Or you can download a cover letter and mail in your verifications. Click the Add a Verification Document button to proceed. Click on the Browse button Locate the document on your computer and select it. Then choose which member of the household has a change to report. And then choose the type of document you will be uploading. In this case we will choose Income Verification. Click the Submit button. Check to make sure you have chosen the correct documents to upload. Click the Next button. Congratulations, you have just successfully uploaded a verification document. You can also send your documents by mail. After clicking the link, you can print out the cover letter and send that along with your documents by mail. This concludes this tutorial.